Well, guys, we made it. Nah, let's talk about Metal Heroes for once. Let's get the elephant in the room out of the way. Kabutaka and Robotak aren't officially part of the Metal Hero series anymore, but I still gotta mention them somehow. After all, there's only one honorable mention this time. I actually like Kabutak's theme. It sounds like it would be on Elite Beat Agents or a Wenden, so that's an automatic win for me. Other than that, I can definitely see why Toei wants to forget that these two exist, since they are a major departure from what Metal Heroes originally was. Kabutak does have a nice theme, but that's about it. As the only mellow song of the Metal Heroes themes, it's pretty nice, but it does sound like an ending theme rather than an opening. The singing is what makes it good in my eyes since the instruments, aside from the guitar, sound kind of generic. I really don't mind that, but this is Metal Heroes, not Sentai. Please don't crucify me, that was a joke. Yes, this is the show that VR Troopers had a lot of basis on. Fun fact aside, I like the theme, but it kind of feels empty. Like it's supposed to be the rough draft. I actually imagined this more of a ninja theme like Jiraiya, but still, you can't go wrong with how smooth Metalder sounds. Not to mention that it's an early theme. Still, there's more to come. Oh, these pronunciations are gonna kill me. Jaban is one step from Metalder with how it's structured. The heroic sounds of the name Jaban are its strongest points, but then it takes a step backwards when the theme tries to sound like it came from Space Sheriffs. At least the bass is funky. Yeah, that's really all I can say. If Metalder was a rough draft, Jiraiya is the final product. Man, it starts strong and ends off stronger as the bigger sound just doesn't stop. I admit, I have a soft spot for ninja themes and this is becoming more of a favorite to me than the Sentai themes. Honestly, it's the big sounding vocals that make me really, really love the song. I just wish other classic themes had the same enthusiasm. Is it the rock thing from Hercules? Is it a VR trooper? It's actually just beyond with this transitional theme between Space Sheriffs and the rest. It keeps a bit of the funkiness that the previous Space Sheriffs had, and it adds a bit more of a darker tone that we'll hear later. I especially love hearing the singer say, come on boy, and just beyond. The visuals are cool, but the theme is even cooler. Just beyond. I mentioned Sentai earlier and probably made that seem like a bad thing, but Soul Brain is the closest to a Metal Heroes theme that sounds like Sentai. And it's awesome. You may recognize a legendary... Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Takoyuchi Miyayuchi singing Soul Brain's theme, which is another automatic plus for me. The theme isn't good just because of him though. Seriously, just listen to how amazing everything sounds. Oh my gosh, I really can't get enough of this. And it's only number four. I'm so sorry, original B-Fighter. You are so close, but B-Fighter Kabuto gets a very, very, very slight edge. You know how I gush about how cool Soul Brain's theme is? Imagine all that, but with B-Fighter Kabuto. It's so catchy, and those instruments are some of the best I've ever heard in Tokusatsu. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Just two more to go. You were probably wondering when any Space Sheriff theme would finally appear on this list. Well, Shiders is my second favorite of the Space Sheriffs. I especially love the little vocal part in the beginning, and while everything else may seem a bit downplayed, it's still a classic Space Sheriff theme. Hearing this again in the new Shider movie just escalated my excitement for possibly even more Metal Heroes. Thank you, Shider. Okay, let's see here. Huh, finally doing Metal Heroes. Well, let's get mentioning some honorables. This one's really hard for me. I like all of these themes equally. They're all just so amazing that I don't know if I can choose one. But, I'll try. My honorable mention goes to Toke Winspecta. 
Most people know of the Space Sheriff trilogy, but most aren't aware of the Rescue Hero trilogy, a series of shows that had no main antagonist, just groups of men, women, and robots protecting Japan from natural disasters. And the first one in the series, Wind Spectre, hit it right out of the park with their opening theme. From the repeated shouting of Mayday, the opening shots of the team saving people from a burning building, and the fact that sung by the same guy who sang the opening themes for Kamen Rider Black RX and Bioman, Wind Spectre's theme is one hot-blooded piece. One that makes anyone who hears it want to leap into action the moment the title is sung. Oh, as an honorable, honorable mention, there's also the French version. God damn, that is cheesy. I know I usually put the quote-unquote classic themes on my list, but this is one that deserves the top spot. Space Sheriff's themes are funky, but Gavin's is my personal favorite of them. I like funk, but Gavin pushed me to listen to it even more. That bass made me want to learn how to be a better musician, and those vocals get me every single time. It may be the one that started it all, but I like Gavin's theme for more than just being a classic. It started a niche legacy in an even more niche genre, and I'm glad it did. You thought I wouldn't put Kabutok on this list? Well, you're right. Thank you guys so much. You can expect a giveaway at 10,000. So like, only a thousand more. We can get there, I hope. Maybe. Possibly. Alright, bye. <laughs>